Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Peanut Butter and Company White Chocolatey Wonderful. A lot of you have requested some for years <laughs> that I try this peanut butter and finally I'm going to get to try it. John sent this to us from Wisconsin. He paid $3.84 for it at Walmart and when he sent it to me, he put a funny little note on it about um, abandoning your calories when you try this so you just have to uh you have to know that it's it's peanut butter you know regular peanut butter does have more calories than powdered peanut butter and john knows that i eat powdered peanut butter so he was kind of warning me you know uh this is so they not sell that flavor at our locally you know they might they might very well sell, oh, okay. uh, sell it uh, you said that people have been asking for it. They yeah. have, but because I don't eat regular peanut butter, uh, that's why I haven't bought it. And I told John even, I said, he, he, he asked me, uh, because he buys several of these at one time. And so he, he asked me on Facebook, do you want me to send you some? And I said, you know, I won't eat it. We'll review it. And, and Kevin might keep it and eat it. And Ashley might eat it. Uh, depends on if he likes it. Um, but I know that I won't eat it. And he's like, well, you know what? I'll go ahead and send it to you and you can give it to Ana and Christina if you don't want to yeah. keep it. Because I- the Kids like peanut butter. Yes. My powdered peanut butter, you get the same amount, which is two tablespoons. Exact same amount is only 50 calories. So two tablespoons of this is 180 calories. So you can see do you want to spend 50 calories or do you want to spend 180? Some people don't care. For me, I do. Yeah, so if, over three times more. Yeah, if you don't care, that's terrific. Uh, but So that's why I haven't bought it is because I knew that basically I would be giving it away. Right. So it is um, vegan and gluten-free, made with USA grown peanuts, simple, honest ingredients. It is peanuts blended with vanilla and cocoa butter for a yummy white chocolatey flavor and i already told you the calories i am going to measure this out not just i i, I have my tablespoon here but we're gonna weigh it out because i want you to know how much you get for your 180 calories it's 32 grams and it does have a protective seal you're getting there on it and sometimes they're awfully hot. yeah but I would rather them have it. Oh yeah. Okay, so 32 grams. You're supposed to get two. Two tablespoons, yeah, so I went over on this one. Ooh, that's 34. Yeah. And this is a tablespoon. Okay, I just got a little over a heaping of this, and yeah, yeah it, you're, it says two tablespoons. Yeah, double check, it does say that. Yeah, okay, let me just let you all know that is not true. No. So, no, it's too much away. How much is it supposed to be? 32. Oh, 32. Um, I put a little over a heaping, and that was it. That was all that you got. Yeah, that's 34. You're not really okay. Perfect, this is 34, so I'm gonna so show So, one heaping you. spoonful is actually a helping. Yeah, one. So, if you're not weighing your peanut butter out you might want to start weighing it out because yeah. if, if you care um my powdered peanut butter i actually weigh it every night i put it on the scale because if i don't i'll go over you um you get 12 grams and so i i weigh out 12 grams and you know it's a perfect amount for a sandwich and see i just don't care so i, I would put like at least twice as much as that on my bread That is delicious. It is very good. Mm, that is good. That would be good on a Ritz cracker. Mm -hmm, that's what I was thinking too. Mm -hmm. Cause you get the salty for a Ritz sandwich, cracker. It would be okay for a sandwich, but I think it would be better on a cracker for me. No, I agree. I think that would make an excellent sandwich. Mm. I, I would like that's that on bread as well. I mean, very good. I get the white chocolate kind of flavor. Yeah, it's not. I mean, not, not white chocolate. Um, yeah, white chocolate. Yeah, well, the vanilla flavor. Vanilla yeah. is what I'm thinking. Vanilla. Yeah, uh, yeah. You get the you get vanilla, but honestly, it's not near as strong as I thought it would be. No, I thought it'd be a lot stronger. Yeah. It tastes very sweet. 
Yeah, Good. it is a vanilla and cocoa butter. Yeah, now I don't get the cocoa really. Mm -hmm. I get more vanilla, and it, like you said, it's kind of a light vanilla. Yeah, butter. it's really, really light, but the, the peanut butter itself is delicious, Could and if you are interested in powdered peanut butter, this same company, uh, Peanut Butter and Company, they make powdered peanut butter, and I did a video. Um, there were four different kinds, and I tried all four in one video, and my favorite one is the vanilla. And as a matter of fact, my sister loves it, and she says it's like a dessert. Uh, she loves it, and we've gotten some of her friends hooked on it. Uh, I bought some for... Um, one of her friends and gave it to her and so uh, it is excellent and honestly i think that vanilla peanut powder has more vanilla flavor than this i and think it's less and it's less calories yes it's only i think it's 50 calories for two tablespoons so John, I know you eat regular peanut butter. However, I would challenge you um, to try that vanilla peanut powder. You'll have to let me know if you can get it into your area. Yeah, I, know, they sell it I know they quit selling it here and I had to order it online. Mm -hmm. uh, they did sell it at Kroger. So he's in Wisconsin. They might still sell it in your, um, in your Kroger in Wisconsin. I know last time, because my sister and I had looked um, so when I ordered it online, I ordered three jars of it. One for me, one for my sister, and one for somebody else to, so they could try it um, because ours didn't have any more. So see if you can find it. I would absolutely love to hear your thoughts on it because I honestly think that it is sweeter than this, if you can believe it. Because this is very, very good, but I swear to you, I think I, think I like the vanilla in that eat better than this. Really? I don't remember. I know people are <laughs> not, they're going to be shocked to hear that because this is so good. I think it was always the texture of the powdered peanut butter that I didn't care for. What a flavor is there, it was the texture. And you can make it as thick or thin, thick or thin as you want. It all depends on how much water uh, that you add to it. So, you know, if and if you get too much water, you can add a little bit more powder to it to make it thicker, to thicken it up. So, it, it's, it's not a big deal if you do add a little bit too much water. But I always use my, uh, my tablespoon and I'll put two tablespoons of powder to one tablespoon of water and it usually ends up being just perfect. So, anyway, I love this. I think very it's good. very, very good. I think it's a keeper, definitely, for, for Kevin and Ashley, don't you? Mm -hmm. I oh, think yeah. Ashley will like this yeah. too. So, thank you very much for sending it to us and thanks for watching.